Hello guys, uh, today I brought you a special video for all the CRM lovers. We have a beautiful CRM next to our computer screen. This is a phenomenal CRM coded in Laravel and Vue.js. And the matter of fact, it is free. Yes, I repeat, it's an open source project by Webcool. And it is one of the free and open source CRM in Laravel community. If you make a GitHub search, I mean, a search on Google Crane CRM, you can find this GitHub link. It has over 11,000 reviews, stars on GitHub. It's a super famous project, tons of reviews and whatnot. I mean, it is filled from features, features, and features. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to set up this CRM within 10 minutes. And before I jump into the setup part, I'm gonna teach you what all, I mean, I'm gonna show you what all is in it there. So let's check it out. So this is the kind of dashboard where you can see the revenue, lost revenue, and all sort of details about the business leads, products and everything. Let's start from the very basic part on the right top corner, we can see my account. From my account, you can change passwords and stuff like this. It's taking a little time. Let it refresh. For some reasons, it's not opening right here. So I'm gonna go to the next point. I'll, I'll download it locally, then I'll show you, okay? Then let's move to the dashboard to lead parts. Here you can have the lead uh, and it's a beautiful Kanban sort of a structure. You can see that this is Kanban. Uh, drag and drop thing you, which you can change the position of a lead from new to follow up, then prospect, then negotiation, then won or lost or whatever. You can filter it. You can have a dashboard view, pipeline view, or you can create your own kind of views. And they recently shifted to a new design now. You see that this is a kind of table view and this is kind of Kanban view. So you can create your leads follow the leads, change the lead status and so forth. And along with leads, you do have the option of course, you can send the quotations to the client, to the lead or contacts. You can directly configure your email. You can set up your email, SMTP IMAP here. You can send and receive emails and see the infrastructure. You can see the activities, what's going on in the pipeline. See, a CRM is going to help you a lot when you have leads and customers you're going to have to follow just to make sure you don't lose any client or you don't lose any work which is supposed to be done. We have the CRMs to take care of that. So it's going to send automated emails and get you the notification and so forth. Then you do have the contacts. Uh, within contacts, you could have a person, an individual. You can add a contact or maybe a contact as a company. So if you go to create contact, you can see name, email, phone number, uh, sales owner and organization and so many details. In the similar way, you can add an organization, a company as a contact, right? Company could have name and all other details. You could have products as well here. May could product could be anything. You can maintain the stocks and so forth. Then we do have... The settings option, under settings, there are a ton of features. You can group the uh, customers or users. Maybe you can make the roles. You may have some employees. You may have some managers and a, a stock keeper, a bookkeeper or anything. Create and manage your roles. Manage your users. Manage the pipeline, you know. Guys, the first condition is a new lead. The second condition is follow up and so forth. Change the pipeline accordingly. You can change the sources. The lead came from Google, Facebook, or whatever source, a reference, web form, anything. You can create your own web forms or sources. Uh, and attributes, you could have product attributes, even email templates, web hookups, workflow, web forms, tags, and whatnot, guys. A free of course CRM. I never seen a product like this before. So I thought, why not? I did use personally this and I loved it and let's check the configuration in the configuration you could have some basic settings the language and so forth so anyway now let's go ahead and jump into the project how we're gonna go ahead and install this on the CRM for absolutely no cost 
Let's check it out. Go to the documentation at the GitHub and it's easy peasy guys. Come here and check the requirement first. I, I don't want you to see a situation. So before you start the installation, you gotta make sure you have these requirements fulfilled in your computer resources. Now, you don't need to install Laravel. It has inbuilt Laravel with the CRM. So all you're supposed to do, copy this command and uh, let me create a folder in my computer. I'm gonna delete the old versions. I was just testing. There we go. So guys, let me increase the size of the screen. Now go ahead and put this command. Com Composer create project crane Laravel CRM hit enter. Take a couple of seconds. It should be installed. Up. Well, yes, it's working. Now in the meantime, let's check the second command. Go to the folder and install the crane. Let's go here and I might fast forward if it takes more than expected time and it's almost done. Let's do it. CD uh, Laravel CRM, that's the name of the folder. Now I'm going to open this into my VS code. And here we're going to put the second command to install it. PHP Artisan Crane CRM and install. Now, the moment you do that, it should start the installation. It says, what is the name of your application? You can type, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna go with the default one, Crane CRM. It is asking local uh, application path. I'm gonna hit enter, stay with the regular one. It is asking the language, I'm gonna say EN for English. Now it is asking for currency. As a bunch of list, I'm gonna say mine is INR, INR. Now it is asking what database you want to use. Let's go with MySQL. The database host, let's stick with the default one. The port, let's stick with the default one. Now enter the database name. Matter of fact, I created the same name of the database. So you can type in the name of your database or create the same name. Let me hit enter. What's wrong? There we go. Okay. Now, please enter the database prefix. I don't want any pre or post fix. The username, it says root. Now, one interesting thing right here, I got stuck when I was testing it, how it works. Uh, it wants you to have a database password. So when in locally, generally, we don't have a password in PHP My Admin, you have the database password is blank. In my case, it didn't work. If in your case, it doesn't work, create a database create a user and get a password. So in my case, I gave the username as my name and the password, let me type it in, hit enter and the magic happens. It's migrating all the tables and done. Now, at this point, I realized it got stuck. The same story is happening right now. So if it takes more than 30 seconds or a minute, don't lose your heart and do control and see stop this process. It should have been done. Right, so I'm gonna say uh, PHP artisan serve. Let's see what happens. And I'm gonna copy this command um, in the URL and I'll paste it right here. And perfect, we got the login screen. Guys, you see that? Now the default password is in the documentation. If you see here, if you, I'm gonna put this link, that's the default username and the password. After installing the CRM guys, you're supposed to clean the route. Let me do that. If there's some caching, then we're gonna say PHP artisan serve and it should work perfectly fine. Now, here's the localhost admin login. That's the username guys. I'm gonna copy, paste, and the password is admin123, right? And login, perfect. Now we do have our own self-hosted CRM. That means you don't, you are not supposed to pay for the license fee. You can create unlimited users, assign the role, do the jobs, get the lead, get the content, contacts, assign to users, follow the leads, and manage your business. 
on the right top corner, we do have the sign. I'm going to click on my account and now it's working right here. I don't know why it was not working the online version on the demo, but it works right here. You can change your password. You can change your username, maybe add a picture of yours and the dashboard has everything. Then you have the leads. You can create the leads, what not. This CRM has almost every sort of top-notch features which you often pay for these sort of technologies. And you even, matter of fact, people pay on the basis of license. If you got five guys in your company, you pay for five license, which is a huge amount of money for a startup. So guys, if you need a CRM or something like this, we are a web development agency based in New Delhi, India. We could hook you up with this technology. CRM is free, but yeah, we, we can set it up for you for some consultation charge or our technology charge. And uh, if you guys have any question and if I give you any value, guys, please subscribe. I literally want you to learn with me, all the developer folks, and I'll... See you in the next one with the next tutorial. Bye for now.